Okay, this, this is a simple electrolysis unit. <coughs> As you can see, we're getting pretty good production. Yeah, pretty good production for a very small cell. I'm using 11 plates. And you can see the amperage use and the voltage use, only 7.75 amps, 12.31 volts, or 37 volts, sorry. Very low. And this little baby here is kicking out right about 1 liter in 3.5 minutes gas production. Again, you can see the cell is very busy. He's hydrolyzing quite a bit. Now flip her off. As you can see that initial burst of speed. You gotta wait till the gas clears a little bit. That what I've done differently, I actually wrapped the plates with plastic, forcing them to travel through the current or the to travel through the plates instead of going around it and increase production quite a bit. Okay, there you can see a plate. Let's see if I can get this anti glare. There. Now you can see the plates. Let's see if put a little light right on it. Now you can see the plates and ready for instant production. One, two, and go. See, very nice. Very nice indeed. That's a very small canister, as you can see. That, and this little canister is putting out on demand. See the little bubbles coming out. Again, this is uh, not a little mag drive. Tube. This is actually a half inch inside diameter tube. So you can read it. There are the specs on the tube itself right there. Half inch inside the diameter and 0.748 outside diameter. Nice tube. That apron shoes went up just a little bit. Uh, 774. It always goes up initially, but you can see it's going back down. And we're right at a hundred, a little over a hundred degrees Fahrenheit. So it's not not so hot you can't pick it up, and that's almost its top speed. It's been running for quite a while. And this is a con collaboration cell between Ironhead and H2O Power. Hope y'all like it.